The response to Aurelia's official Christmas tree has been less than glowing. Bemusement over why the tree is decorated the way that it is has become a talking point since a tree lighting ceremony that happened over the weekend. CTV's Christian Davino joins us live now with more on the tree. And uh, it seems, Christian, that it's a little light on the lights. Sarah, it certainly is. It's uh, rather unusual, that's for sure. Look, I've counted some of the positives, and what I can say, the lights are rather beautiful, but the downside, it's just around the trunk of the tree. In fact, my our, our director, Troy, actually whispered in my ear asking if I was in Florida. It looks kind of more like a palm tree than a Christmas tree. To that I say, I wish it certainly would be a lot warmer. Now, it's really putting Aurelia on the map for all the wrong reasons right now. In fact, people online are saying this is the worst Christmas tree lighting they've ever seen. And some of the people I spoke with today shared that sentiment. Four. I think we have an effective tree. <laughs> <laughs> an underwhelming tree lighting, to say the least. The lights wrapped solely around the trunk, making headlines. And they thought it would be, you know, uh, festive, a little un unconventional. Yeah, it is. And going viral across social media. Aurelia's Christmas tree, the talk of the town, for reasons not quite so festive and jolly. That's the first time I've ever seen it where it's basically like a tree trunk lighting. A little yeah, weird. Yeah, a little yeah, weird. Definitely. yeah, definitely. And nothing in the branches. Yeah. That's, no. that's that is an interesting thing, today. yeah. One woman finding the joy in the whole situation. They were great. Always good. You thought it was good? Yeah. But overwhelmingly, a question of why. I don't know about that. Well, one. I left the tree up there, huh? Yeah, I know, but is this a half of... Uh, no, it's a whole tree. Look. It's a half of uh, okay. lights. Sure. Yeah, well, why didn't you just decorate the whole thing? <laughs> eh? <laughs> Longtime city councilor Ralph Sapola has been fielding those same questions nonstop. <laughs> Some of the comments have been humorous, and, and but you know what? It's for the kids. The kids love the Christmas tree, and this does not represent a Christmas tree. The reason, according to Cipolla, is one of age. The tree's branches too weak to hold on to Christmas lights. Now he's asking the rest of city council to bring in another to hold a second lighting. If you look at other cities like Barrie, Toronto, they have huge, big Christmas trees, and I think there's no reason why we can't have one the same. And I spoke with the company that actually decorated the tree. They told me that this is certainly the weirdest way they've ever strung up Christmas lights. However, they do certainly find a lot of humor in the fact that this is going viral online, Sarah. <laughs> Thank you very much, Christian. It's uh, something to be known for anyhow. That's Christian DeVino reporting live from Aurelia tonight.